guys welcome to another tutorial video for open app sec um once again this is not a sponsored video so we're just gonna head straight into it um open app sec uh we learned how to install open app sec and set it up with nginx proxy manager um in our previous video and remember when you first set up open app sec you are using the simple ai model so if you head over to your agent and right here we have our agent um you can see that the ai model version we're currently using is the simple model version 1.0 open app sec advises that you move on to the advanced ai model um, before you start doing the learning process for open app sec so um, in this video today we're going to learn how we can install and set up the advanced ai model if you just installed your open app sec agent you're also going to get this message on here um, telling you the same thing that for enhanced security and accuracy you should update to the advanced ai model so for us to do this you need access to your command line or terminal um so you're going to need ssh access and if you have ssh access obviously you can also do sftp access um, so once you have your ssh access uh, we're going to head back on here you want to go to where you have your profile and you want to go all the way down to download the advanced ml model so when you select that option you're going to have to accept this license um, i highly advise that you read this um, but for this video we're just going to accept and we're going to download and once you're done uh, if you head over to your downloads folder you're going to see on here that we have this um, .tgz file so we want to put this file into our open app sec uh, virtual machine or nginx proxy manager virtual machine using sftp okay so if we head back over to the command line uh, we go to our sftp we're going to use the command put and we're going to copy and put that in there so once we do that open up sec oh uh, sorry um the, we're basically moving the open app sec advanced model um file we downloaded into our uh, virtual machine so if we go back to our ssh session and we go to var sorry not var home slash uh tt admin which is the user um that i use to sf uh tp into that machine so once you do that yours is going to be different so whichever user you use you want to go into their home directory so we're going to move this file from that home directory to where we have our open app sec files in our case here um we have that in the root directory so if i ls we're just in root um it is advisable that when you first install open app sec you should install it in a specific directory but hopefully you've done so for this video we're just loading up the advanced ai model so once we have that we're going to run the command to create a new directory within um our open app sec docker um, directory so we're going to run the command make the um, we'll call that directory open app sec advanced model okay if we ls now we have that added in here okay so we're going to cd into this alrighty and then once we do that now we're going to use the move command okay um, we basically want to move this file from where it is right now and then we want to move that into um, the root dash open up sec directory okay and once we do that if we ls now you can see we have that in here so once that's done we want to go ahead and open up our um, docker compose.yaml file once you open this up you want to come down to the appsec agent um, under the volumes so on the last um, option we have under the volumes you want to create a new one uh, i have all these commands copied and pasted obviously in the uh, description section below so you can just copy and paste them so once you do that we're going to add this in here okay so once you add that in here we're basically loading um 
the open AppSec advanced model we just downloaded into our open AppSec agent uh, docker image and we're giving it read and write permissions so once we do that we'll save that and you want to run docker compose down and you wait for that to stop and once that's complete we're going to run the docker compose up dash d command to reload the docker images for nginx proxy manager and appsec agents so we're going to do docker compose up dash d so once you do that and that's complete you get no errors if we head back over to our web browser and we refresh this page you should now see that we have been moved to the advanced model so when you first refresh the page if that doesn't work right away you can refresh a couple of times um because uh, sometimes there's a delay um it took me 10 seconds so i had to refresh the page two times for um open appsec to be able to update um, and communicate with the agent i have locally to make sure that it has the advanced model okay um and that's it you can see the error has been automatically um, removed by itself i didn't do anything and that's just all you need to do to set up the open AppSec advanced model so i hope this video helps you um, if you have any questions about the video you can head over to the geek together hub which is our forum and post a question or you can leave a question down in the comment section below please do not forget to also like and subscribe to the channel